So we're very fortunate today because we have some, some wonderful people who are endorsing um, Judy. And so I'd like to introduce them first. Um, first we have Nick Valentine. Woo! Thank you. I bring a little different outlook to this today. Um, some three and a half years ago, the city of Newburgh, uh, in an overwhelming majority of like 70 percent uh, that's not what you got but you did pretty good okay but the the charter was changed and uh it's been a remarkable three and a half years if you've watched the city council and its decision making uh, we have a city manager now that uh, was chosen by a super majority not just a regular majority that meant an awful lot i was through all of the years of a simple majority and the the, the city managers would come and go like a revolving door. Uh, but not only that, when the charter was passed, it was passed with that 70% polarity of the voters, and that is huge. We've got somebody running on the other Democratic line that doesn't like it, and he's made no bones about it. He's said it at council meetings. He tried a couple of different moves to, to knock it down, to try to destroy it, and to try to compromise it. Um, we, we are a city of people that elect not only their elected officials, but they also make the decision on what kind of government they want to see. Judy has said that this is the type of government that the people want, and she has fought for that over these last three and a half years. So if we do not re-elect her, and he does get in, he will do everything in his power to try to knock this down whatever way you can. And by the way, he's an attorney. He'll try to look at every way, little way to twist and turn. I would have never won with just the Republican vote. So I did an outreach to every citizen in the city and every voter, every block association, and I said, you know what? We need to come together, and we need to fight together, and we need to lead together. So my support is with Judy. It is going to be a challenge. The independence party line, you gotta look for it, you gotta think, you gotta you gotta take the extra step as a voter. But I believe that we have those voters in this city that would do that. And I just am, am totally supporting her. I believe we need that consistency in Newburgh to stay for these next four years. Because the new people, and there's a lot of you out in this audience, and I know it, the new people are watching what happens in November and whether or not they decide to move here, open their business here, raise their families here. It's, it truly is one of the most important election cycles that I think I've ever seen, and I've been watching them personally for over 20 years. So, Judy, all the best of luck to you, but more than luck, you will do this with hard work and with the support that you see around you today. Thank you very much.